thinking back over the history of ANU, 20 years now of Africa Nazarene University. ANU began in 1994 with 63 students in three academic programs. And here on this campus, our main campus, we had just uh, the Jernigan Chapel and a few uh, of the residential halls that now belong to the men uh, for the men's dormitory. And uh, that was, you know, that was before I had arrived here. Uh, but the university has grown consistently over the years, impacting the lives of uh, young people. As uh, the director of this uh, campus, uh, I've seen the, the, the Nairobi campus grow and maybe I've grown with it uh, spiritually, academically, socially and uh, I'm well, um, it has added a lot of value to me in as much as I've added value to the institution. I've learned so much from the students and also from the programs which are here. And as a Christian also, I feel like I'm at home. When you are in the environment that you are familiar with, you feel you are in the right environment. Uh, because also the, we have the spiritual leaders here, we have the counselors here. So even the students say whenever they come here with problems, the university transforms them to be maybe the kind of people that God wanted them to be. Um, the importance of what we want to emphasize is that this is our time to come together as a community and really see and hear what God is saying to us as a community. Um, it is a time to reinstill what's important and the values that we hold that are important here. Um, character, competence, community are all a part of what Christ wants us to be in our world. What I have from my previous experience, what I like most about Nazarene University and uh, more so the faculty here at the Nairobi campus and mass communication in specific is that there is cordial relationship, that um, we work as a team and we try to work through the problems and the issues that we encounter on a daily basis. When I was looking for education, I was looking for a place where I could fit in as well as get quality education. And African Nazarene University did it for me. I found it was a place where there was guidance, mentorship, and I found a place where I could grow individually as well as spiritually. ANU is not a for-profit university. Um, we want to offer programs, we want to offer education that will, that will meet a need in our country, in our society, in our world, uh, and to prepare students to go out and address, address those needs. We have competent faculty and we try as much as possible to offer quality education because basically our mission is to offer holistic education and uh, being a Christian centered uh, uh, institution our major emphasis is to provide a Christ like uh, uh, centered uh, kind of education where we are concerned about uh, character of students and integrity at heart because um, in the world today uh, it's not only the academics, it's not only the papers, but also who are you, the soft skills. And the world is looking for people of integrity and not only the, the academics. So that makes us uh, different from other universities that are actually focusing on academics only. So for us, we look uh, physically, mentally, uh, academically, socially. So we, we, we really work on our core values. Uh, the three C's, that is character, competence, and community. Our alumni are doing great in the world out there. We have an alumni board of leaders here, the chairperson being Mr. Edwin Wanyonyi. I believe you have met him before. And um, the office is at this time working with uh, representatives of alumni in different parts of the world to ensure that alumni are giving back 
to the institution and helping the institution grow in meeting its uh, goals and objectives. I enrolled for my studies at African Nigerian University in 2005 and I want to believe that was an opportune time in my academic life because that was when the mass communication department at African Nigerian University was being was like the newest department amongst the newest departments and during that time we were just uh, eight in the class and uh, I believe it's a time that I learned during my four years here. Having graduated in 2008, it was a time in my life that a lot was instilled in me. The university instilled a lot of competencies and skills that I apply to my life now, my professional life and even my personal life, bearing in mind the three core values that were instilled in us, character, competence and community. And I do not believe I would have had this, I believe, that I, I would not have had this academic experience anywhere else, in any other university. So I really thank God for bringing me to Africa as a real university. Yeah. As a leader, African Nazarene has helped me be able to be competent to the people that I am leading. I am able to show responsibility to that which they have entrusted me to be or to do in this leadership position. And um, it is through that that I've been able also to become um, a very accountable leader, both to my government and both to the leaders out there. And um, it has helped me also as a person to be able to manage myself better in terms of time, in terms of responsibility, in terms of balancing my tasks and duties. And this has helped me become a greater person, I would say. So we produce quality students, we offer quality education, and it, I can say it's a very rich environment so far. And um, there's a lot of togetherness of faculty and even the students. And basically we call ourselves a community. Uh, of African Nazarene University. So I think this is the right place to be as far as I'm concerned. I've also brought relatives here who have performed very well and I'm very proud of this place. I'm very proud of being the director of here and I thank God for everything. I also want to thank the Vice Chancellor uh, Leah Marango for the kind of support she's given us and actually she's my role model. Yeah. I feel good about what ANU has done for me. I feel, I feel good about what I have been able to do for ANU and the larger society. And uh, I uh, believe there's a great future in store for African Nazarene University and I hope to be part of that uh, as, long as, I, as long as the Lord wishes, I guess. Um, and I, I am happy for all of the students who get to pass through these gates and pass through our community, especially when they are receiving those certificates on graduation day and going out into the world well prepared to meet the challenges of their time. Uh, that comes right from our, our vision statement. So um, I'm glad to be part of the story of ANU. I am defiant to any limitation. I am responsible to carry out a mission. I am a leader with a revolution. I am filled with motivation. I am aware of my social responsibility and I am so ready to give this mission. I am a product of African Nazarene University. African Nazarene University. What begins here transforms the world.